Hey Capricorn, welcome back to the channel. My name is Nelly, aka Owl Tarot, and I'm here to give you guys your weekly message. We're going to tap into this energy, see what is coming towards you guys this week. But before we get started, if you are new to the channel, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell so you can be notified when I post a new reading. If you are a returning subscriber, guys, thank you so much for all your love and support. I appreciate every single one of you guys. Alrighty, my uh, my Capricorns, I'm about to say Aquarius, you may be dealing with an Aquarius. Alright, Capricorn, as you all know, my readings are for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. These are timeless general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. There is no gender in tarot, guys. Please reverse the rules as need be, and... Cross watchers, you are always welcome. Guys, don't forget to check your other placements so you get a better understanding of this energy. And if anyone wants to book a personal reading, the info is in the description box below. So I got two cards that just flew out. And I'm going to go ahead and take them, okay? The first one is availability. There will be so much support in this relationship. Everything ranging from emotional support to basic needs. And then we got reunion. Both of you have learned a lot about yourselves and understand that the potential of your connection and understand the potential of your connection. This reunion will be physical in nature. So I feel that you guys are finally coming back into union. Like things are starting to open up for you. Okay, there's there's support in this connection. Like I feel that the time that you have been in separation with this person. You've realized a lot. You have learned a lot. And you, you, one thing you guys did come to an understanding is that this is the person for you. This is the person you want to be with, the person that you want to build a life with. For some of you guys, you may have already gotten a phone call from this person or a text message because really who calls nowadays? Now they kind of text for everything um, that they want to meet up. So you guys are going to physically see each other and pretty much sit down and have a much needed conversation here. So there's a reunion. You're just going to check your schedule for your availability here. <laughs> Let's see here. Five of Wands. Some of you guys may be fighting this person off. Like, I feel that, and not physically, okay? What I mean is, like, you're going to reunite with this person. You're going to, well, you're going to go see this person. You may even have coffee, and this person's going to try to touch you, hold you, kiss you. And you're going to be a little bit standoffish. You're going to be like, mm, no, we can't get there yet, okay? Right now, you need to give me my space. Right now, you need to let me breathe and let me feel this situation. Now, this person's coming towards you for one thing and one thing only. There you go, your reconciliation. Capricorn, you guys are reconciling. This person is coming towards you as we speak. This is going to be a very unexpected communication, okay? Capricorn, you guys actually, actually had thought that this relationship was dead and gone, okay? Ten of swords in the reverse. But truth be told that there is a ending to this painful situation already. There's going to be an opportunity to have a restart, I just heard. Okay, have an opportunity to do this relationship all over again. This person sees you as their soulmate. You see them as your soulmate. There's definitely a reunion that's getting ready to happen. A reconciliation here. There is a no doubt about it, Capricorn. You will be reconciling with this person this week. The devil in the reverse. Okay, in the past, there could have been a lot of toxicity, possibly a lot of drinking, other addictions, hanging out with third parties. And again, guys, third parties aren't always sexual connections, just could be people interfering in the connection. I feel in the past, Capricorn, that your person was more loyal to their friends and family than they were to you. Okay, but now this person has released, removed those toxic people, behaviors, places, and things. Okay, this person wants to end this painful separation. They want an opportunity to come towards you with this Queen of Swords and speak the truth. Okay, this person may have physically moved away from you. You guys could have shared a home together. You guys could have been living near each other. And I feel that this person physically just relocated. Well, now they're trying to pack that car back up and come home to you. Okay, now they're wanting to come back towards you. They want this reunion. They want this re 
this this relationship back with the seven of pentacles i feel that your person capricorn has matured okay and this whole time that you guys have been separated they've learned a lot okay they've learned how they do not need to be putting their friends and family before their connection, okay? They've realized that they have a lot of love for you, that they want to be with you, that they want to build a future with you. This person has learned a lot. I feel that they have grown. They've matured. Also, they, they continue thinking about the past. They think about the future. This person misses you with the hermit, okay? This person is lonely without you. This person wants to come towards you. They want to open up, Capricorn. They want to express... The the fact that they're in love with you six of cups that they want a reunion or reconciliation okay some of you guys may even have children with this person who knows but at the end of the day this person wants a reconciliation they want to come back towards you with the knight of wands here they're coming in very passionately with the three of wands here this person's plotting and planning their return okay this person is planning how they're going to come towards you to communicate this to you to reconcile with you to open up with you what else universe you got the judgment, guys. It's time for truth, clarity, the whole truth and nothing but the truth. Final decisions here. This person, because when they walked away from you, when they decided to disconnect from you, everything just fell apart for them. Okay? Everything fell apart. The friends that were near them, they only had these people around them because they were victorious with you. You pushed this person to do better. You made sure this person followed through with everything that they promised. And the second your person moved away from you because they wanted to be a follower and follow their friends and family, everything started falling apart for them. They were no longer in the spotlight. They were no longer the go-to person. Why? Because at this point, everybody had managed to pull the person away from you. Now that they had them, they want to send them back. Okay? Okay. So they were not victorious with you. They were no longer the person that everybody wanted to hang out with. Now your person became the world's most boringest person. Nobody was calling them. Okay. Five of Swords in the reverse. This person knows that in the past they were being very deceptive. Okay. They could have run away from the situation. They, they could have been putting, unfortunately, putting you in third party situations or just constantly lying. But with the Five of Swords in the reverse, this person wants to make amends. They want to come towards you. They want to end this painful situation. They want to leave the past in the past. And they want to move forward. With the Ace of Wands, this person is going to be very passionate. They're going to communicate that they want a new beginning with you, Capricorn. That they want to move forward with you in this union. Okay? This person has a lot of passion for you. That's why I said at the beginning of the reading, when you and this person physically come towards each other, you're still going to be in this temperance in the reverse. You're not sure if you want to trust this person's intentions. You're not sure if this person is is really coming in here for truth, clarity, harmony, peace, reconciliation. You're going to be a little bit standoffish. But at the end of the day, Capricorn, I do not know what to tell you. But you're definitely reconciling this weekend, baby. Or this week, I apologize. Okay? All right, guys. I hope and pray that this reading gave you clarity. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell. And if you guys want to book a personal, the info is in the description box below. Talk to you soon. Bye.